Welcome back. Your gas price is on the rise here in Connecticut. According to Gas Buddy, prices have risen 11.8 cents in the past week. The average price at the pump is $3.92 a gallon. It's still lower than the national average, which is up $4.4 .4 cents per gallon at $4.11. The Attorney General's office says 200 complaints have been reported here in the state suspecting gas stations of price gouging. Fox 61's Lauren Zenzi has the latest from that report. It has been nearly a month since the 25 cent gas tax holiday went into effect and the attorney general's office is encouraging anyone who witnesses price gouging to report it. Over the past month, the attorney general's office received 200 complaints. Over 100 letters have been sent out to gas stations requesting additional information in response to those complaints. And so far, 65 responses have been received, 41 found no violations, and 24 of them are still under review. Now, as summer comes around, prices are continuing to be on the rise. In addition to the constantly changing market, some commuters say the lower gas prices have given them more spending cash for the little things. It's definitely nice being a commuter and seeing the prices go down because it, it's essential. It definitely had me stop spending money on other things. Senate Majority Leader Chuck Schumer says corporate greed is partially to blame for sky-high prices, saying the war in Ukraine is being used as an excuse to raise prices. But he has a plan. It's not the moms and pops who run these, who's run these gas stations who are at fault. It's their corporate parent. Go after the oil companies and go after gouging. The American Petroleum Institute says gas prices are not set by specific oil companies. And for individual gas stations, it all depends on how quickly they go through their supply on hand and how much it costs to replenish it. In Hartford, Lauren Zenzi, Fox 61 News.